Bill and Hillary Clinton's 13-city speaking tour opened in Toronto to a near-empty arena and a coughing fit. The Daily Mail reports that this latest money grab from the Clintons managed to attract only 3,300 in a stadium that holds 19,800 which works out to 83% empty. This figure is made even more embarrassing by the fact that as the date of the event neared, the venue was not able to give tickets away at just $6.55 each. Ticket prices started between $200 and $53 Canadian. On top of that, in the middle of the event, Hillary had one of her famous coughing fits while the aging Clintons spent much of the night bashing President Trump. They did so in front of a nearly empty room that proves just how out of touch they have both become. The belief they could fill a hockey arena is the worst kind of vanity. Had the event taken place at a smaller venue, the Clintons' diminishing appeal would not have been quite so obvious. Meanwhile, Hillary's nemesis, one Donald Trump, continues to draw crowds who wait in line all day and then fill arenas up to the rafters. The Clinton tour is promoted by Live Nation and promoted as a one-of-a-kind conversation with a former president and secretary of state. But with questions such as, why does Putin hate you so much? You seem like a very nice person. Do people really want to leave their homes and spend good money to watch what appears to be just another cable news segment? As the American thinker points out, while 3,300 tickets sold at prices ranging from $53 to over $200 still yields a healthy payday, even after expenses, the optics are terrible, which is something even the far-left CNN is pointing out. I just think the optics of going to an event where people are paying to see them, and they are financially gaining from this, I am not sure that is the right way to reingratiate them back into the public sphere, said a former Clinton aide. They haven't gone away, and I don't want them to go away, but I am not sure this is the right venue from an optics standpoint. The Toronto Star's review of the night earned the headline, Hillary and Bill just won't go away. If this were a free tour, or a tour where all the profits went to charity, the optics would be much better. As it is, especially when you remember the Clintons are already worth hundreds of millions of dollars, it looks like just another cynical cash grab for two people who already have more money than they could ever hope to spend.